So let's begin our webinar tonight. What I want to do is I want to take you through a journey using essentially three pieces of uh, property that uh, we have been using for 21 years that has helped us enormously to be able to help many, many people out there. So just to give you a little bit of a sense of where I'm coming from tonight is I founded a company by the name of Life Beyond Limits, what we incorporated in March 2004. And essentially what we did is we built a business helping many, many people uh, with coaching, training, books, uh, audios, so many different resources. And tonight what I want to do is I want to share what we did and what were some of the key things that helped us back then to launch our business and really grow into a, into a very large business in a very short space of time? But also what has been serving us for uh, 21 years now. So we've been using the same strategy and it's just been working again and again and again. So we've gotten very, very good at this. And what I want to do is I want to share it with you. So um, without further ado, what I'd like to do is jump onto our PowerPoints, uh, not literally, here we go. So tonight, what I'm talking about is the secret source of monetizing your message with public speaking and how to skyrocket your business using these particular strategies. So this training is for you if you've if you feel or get a sense that you have an important message for the world or your community and it's just not reaching the number of people that you desire or is lead generation important to you but you're not getting the leads that you need to meet your vision are you falling short of the number of clients you need to be profitable and want clients in large numbers do you get a sense that increasing your credibility is a key to your ultimate success and you certainly want to lift it that is your credibility so this is for people who are coaches who want more clients potential authors who want to supplement their income business owners who want to generate more leads and anyone who wants to be a force for good now let's start firstly with who am i so I can give you a sense of my background. So in 2002, I studied coaching, NLP, and then I went on to learn a whole host of other different modalities, some for the sake of curiosity, others because I really believe that there's some really great value in them. And I did kinesiology, metaphysics, clean language reset, and a whole host of lots of other modalities. But just to give you a sense, I... I essentially came into this industry with um, a knowledge, a lot of book knowledge. You know, I've been reading psychology books since I was seven years old, but I came in fairly fresh into this. Uh, my background is I used to work in advertising. I have started many advertising agencies, and then I sold my last advertising agency in 1995, and completely got out of that industry, but went on to the other side into the marketing industry. So I worked at News Limited for quite a number of years in marketing, helping them problem solve and helping build brands and things like that. And then I went into sales. So I went on the other side and, uh, and then I came into coaching in 2002. I positioned myself as a brain untrainer. It was a title that one of my clients gave me when I helped him to get out of a debilitating illness. And he said to me, he said, you're not a coach, you're not a trainer, you're a brain untrainer. And I really love that. And uh, so I called myself a brain untrainer for, uh, well, probably since about 2005, 2006, thereabouts. Now, to date, I've completed about 38,000 hours of transformational work. I won the APAC award in uh, this year uh, for transformational coaching. And I've now authored seven best-selling books. So I love contributing into this space. I love giving my knowledge. And uh, tonight is no different. I want to give you a lot of my knowledge, but not so much in the self-development space 
more so in the business space. So uh, to give you a sense, I annually uh, allot 50 coaching places. Uh, I currently only have three more places left this year. So nearly all of those spaces or the large majority of those spaces have all been taken up. And uh, I'm a master NLP trainer and our 2023 courses are all filled all but one. And I coach and teach from the comfort of my home now. And the reason I'm sharing this is I want to give you the formula as to how I've actually achieved this level of success. And uh, let's jump into what I call my three-phase power system. So the first thing that's really critical in moving into the space of gaining any level of success if you're a consultant or a coach or a healer or a trainer, or even if you're an author or anyone who essentially needs clients or customers, a really important thing is message. Now, I spent many years in the advertising industry and people would literally pay us millions of dollars to come up with messages and be able to look at what is the value that you have and how can we communicate that value in a, in a short, compelling sentence. And this is a really key piece. It's literally the first piece that you want to start from to be able to communicate your value out into the market. And in a moment, I'll show you some strategies to help you to hone and define your message. So the next thing that you really need to do is you need to jump into your package. You know, um, so once people hear what you can provide, then you've got to have something that they can get the promise of your message. So I'm calling that package. And I'll explain a little bit more what I mean about that. This is, of course, the big picture. The third thing is that a real super skill to be able to blend these together, and there's many strategies, but this is one strategy that has worked again and again. We've taught this to so many coaches and so many people who get out there and help people like trainers and authors, and this has worked for all of them. So the next piece is the present piece. And the ultimate reason that I talk about the three-phase power system is that what it enables you to do is essentially build your own bank. Now, what do I mean by that? What I literally mean is that, you know, if, if, you, if you need funds, like if you, if you want to create, you know, some funds to finance this or finance that, you know, most people go to their bank and they'll get a loan and, you know, with that loan, they can, you know, do whatever they want to do, grow their business, buy a home, buy this, buy that. What we have done is instead we go out there and we run our system and then that system then finances us. We've never gone out and got a business loan ever. Um, we have bootstrapped and financed our own business. And the formula that I want to share with you tonight is exactly how you do that. So this is the three-phase formula is how my business has prospered for 21 years. So let me go into this from firstly what I see happens so much is the biggest problem I personally see is coaches and course creators and business owners who have a lot of talent, a lot of expertise, but they have no income or they have little income. And the reason for that, in my view, is that it's mostly due to their lack of message, their lack of packages, and their lack of talks or, or a vehicle that can leverage their message. And I'll talk more about that in a moment too. And as a result, they lack income. So this formula that I'm sharing with you is very, very much geared towards the bottom line. And uh, most business owners love this sort of stuff because it really does make a difference. It makes an impact on the bottom line. 
So the first thing I'm going to talk about is that first part of the trilogy or the or, or, or the, the three components that really help you to do that. And the first is monetizing your message. So how do you literally start? It's actually easier than you think it is. The first question you've really got to answer is what is the best value that you offer people? So what is the thing that you're really good at that allows people to extract some value from you? So that's the first question that you've really got to answer, and that's the value piece. So the way you need to think about this is don't think about being valuable to everyone. You know, you're not Coca-Cola. Um, not that Coca-Cola has got a lot of value other than um, feeds the dental industry. But what I mean by that is what you don't want to be valuable to everybody but you want to be really, really valuable to one group. So, for example, the group that I am valuable to are often people who want to be coaches, people who want to learn NLP, people who want to learn to be a public speaker. So there's a lot of things that I can offer of value to people, but when we are marketing we are typically focusing in on one group with one value. So the more specific you can get, the better this formula is going to work for you. So the next question to ask is who needs it most? You know, and that's going to determine who actually is going to pay you the most for your offer. Now, to give you a sense of this, uh, today I was mentoring uh, some of my students and we were going through this particular process and something that I've noted over the years is when we coach and mentor and we go through this process and we go we start going deep and people find their niche it makes a massive difference to people's success it really really does it makes marketing easier it makes your message easier it makes your programs easier when you're designing them and thinking them out. So this is, so we've spoken about the what and the who. The who is the pain piece. So people with the greatest need or the greatest pain will typically pay you the most. The third question to ask yourself is why would they come out of their hole and pay me? Now, the first thing we've got to understand is that people are typically fearful. Most people are a bit fearful to try anything new. In fact, most people would prefer to stick with the problem than actually come out of their hole and do something about their problem. You know, And what I mean there is that a lot of people just tolerate their problems. They, they really do. Now, that might not be you um, because you're listening to this webinar and chances are it's not you, but there are, it surprises me how many people will tolerate a problem until it becomes such a critical problem. So the thing that you want to be able to do is entice them, entice them with again, something that is going to really give them an opportunity to gain something in their life. And the bigger the gain, the more likely they will come out of that hole. Now, the fourth thing you need to be able to do now having all this information is how can I form my message in one compelling sentence? So your answer is basically from garnering or answering those first three questions because that's going to help you to know who it is that will pay you the most. It also tells you why they're going to come out of their hole, why they're going to approach you for some help. And it also helps you to know what is the best value for you. Now, I could answer these questions in a number of different ways, depending upon what I'm focusing on. And I do quite a few things. You know, I'm a trainer, I'm a coach, and I'm also an author, and I also have a mass of 
audios, you know, hypnotic audios, transformational meditational audios. So it really depends on what area I'm looking at. So let me be quite specific. Let's talk about how I would answer this as a coach. So when I, uh, when I answer the question, what is the best value I offer people? The best value that I offer people is I untrain people's brains often to increase their income. So a lot of people come to me because they know that there's a glass ceiling and they know they've hit it. They know that they're, you know, just incrementally or by CPI, they're increasing their income, but they're, they've hit a glass ceiling. They, they can't hit, you know, the, the, the five figures or the six figures or the seven figures. So what my job is, is to help them to find out what that limit is. What are the limits that is stopping them from breaking through that glass ceiling? So that's my value answer as a brain untrainer. So who needs it most and will pay the most for my offer? Well, they're typically people like business owners because they know that when they shift their thinking, they know that what they pay me, they can get again and again and again by 10x multiples and beyond. So it makes financial sense for them to really answer that problem. So why would they come out of their hole and pay me? Well, they can literally double, triple, or even tentuple their income based on the size of their business, of course. So that's the reason that they would come out of their hole. So how can I form my message in one compelling sentence? So my message is increase your income by untraining your brain. Very simple. You know, it's a very simple proposition that essentially says increase your income by untraining your brain. Very simple. So this gives you just one example of how you can use these questions to typically determine what is the best value you can provide, who needs it most, why would they come to you, and how can you put that in a compelling sentence so that people can really get you. Now, these questions we all know in coaching help people to get beyond their problem points because we we learn in coaching what sort of questions can we ask to help that person get their ahas, to help them shift their thinking. So equally to shift your business, good questions create great businesses. Great questions can create awesome businesses. So this is your home play. You know, uh, screen capture this or ask me at the end of this webinar, to provide you with the PowerPoints or however you want to capture this, go ahead and capture these questions and perhaps the examples because it can help you to really monetize your message. So the first thing you've got to do is answer these questions. So um, here is someone who certainly answered these questions and he said, Rick helped me to more than double my income. My entire family have now done this program and it's simply life-changing. So the program that he's talking about, essentially uh, he's done a, a number of our programs, but the, the real piece that helped him shift his income was our life coach and NLP practitioner program. And then he went on to do our speaker program, which gave him a hell of a lot more confidence so those programs were the, he was, he's really talking about our life coach program, but it was those two programs that made a big, big difference in his life. So um, that's Hector OJ, a lovely, lovely man, I must say. And Vladimir Platil said, Rick is a genius in the mind space. He helped me to double my income. I literally blew his mind when he, this particular thing happened and he was shocked that his limitations had held him back. Now, the only reason you can get testimonials like this is because you've done the work and you've answered those questions because he wouldn't know that that was on the table or the offering was there unless you can really capture your messages by answering those questions. 
So what happens as a result of getting really good is you start to get lots and lots of testimonials because you've been able to answer that question because people want to know what is the value you provide? How can you help moi? How can you help me? And when you can answer that question, then people will come. So this is one part, one part of three. So testimonials are awesome, but you won't get them until you do this next piece. So that's the package piece, the package to please. So what you want to do here is now begin to, once you've got your message, you then want to think about, okay, so what is my package that I can put together that can really help my audience? So just to give you a sense of this, if my message is how to untrain your brain and increase your income or how to untrain your brain to increase your income, then you've got to think, how can you do this? So my first package of this was actually a book. So what I did is I wrote a book. It wasn't called A Richer Way to Think in the beginning. Its title, I don't think, was as good as that. It was actually A Life Beyond Limits, and that was the, the name of the book. It later became A Richer Way to Think. But essentially, people could read that book and through that book, they started to realize that they had capped their income based on their belief systems, based on their patterns, based on all the stuff that typically as a coach, I would untrain so that they could lift the limitation. So that became my, my, my program essentially. Now it translated into many other ways. So uh, we created a two-day event, which was called How to Break Through Your Limits. Again, you can start seeing the mesh of the message. So they're, they're fairly similar and they have similar promises. So these are other ways to position your message because you can't keep going out with the very same message all the time. You see advertisers do this all the time. They will say it's a sale, but it's not the sale that was. It's now a new sale. And they, you know, they take different spins on that. So these are essentially different spins, like how to limit fear and calm your ego in less than 10 minutes or 10 minutes or less. Um, that's a bit of a quirky spin on it. Confident beyond limits. Um, these are some of our meditational transformational audios. By the way, these things are free on YouTube. So if you get onto our YouTube channel, there's a whole heap of resources on there. Become a master manifester like Buffett. That was a video that was very much about my book, A Richer Way to Think. So these are all free. So the book is small fee. And then, of course, I have other programs which are medium fee. So, you know, they are like my life coach and NLP practitioner training, um, the next advancement on that, the master coach, speaker, speaking with confidence and trainers training. So if you look at these as a flow, what typically happens is when you build free content, this is the stuff where people can get a sense of you and it's free so that they can watch and listen and learn and start to get a sense of your value. Now, from that, you know, like free programs typically take people only so far. They take them to a particular depth. And because people don't like to spend too long in free content, you know, they'll jump from content provider to content provider to content provider. And, you know, sure, they might spend half a day even doing that, but they typically don't spend half a day with one provider. You know, they'll jump around. So you make them short and you make them free. But what happens as a result is once people get a sense of how much you know and the value that you have and where you can take people and how you can take them beyond their limits, of course, pardon the pun. But what happens then is they then go, I really want to go deeper. So the book is very small fee, but allows people to go much, much deeper. 
And then, of course, if you really want to build skill, for example, then they can go to our next level products over here. Now, you get great testimonials from great programs and you often don't get testimonials from your free stuff, but you will get testimonials from your fee stuff, you know, your deeper level stuff. And we get the best testimonials ever from our actual programs because these help people to achieve the thing that they couldn't achieve on their own. So sure, you can also get testimonials from your book as well, but you will rarely get testimonials from your free stuff. You know, they're to give people a sense of you and sure, to get little tips and tricks and things that you put out in your videos, but the real value tends to be in your fee stuff and your, you know, in your small fee and medium fee and even your large fee stuff. So this is thinking about package. So, you know, if you're going to go out there with value, the next question, and you've got a great message, the next question you've got to ask is where am I taking people to? Where are they starting? Where am I taking them to? So when you've got those two pieces, of course, the steps in between become your program. So you're teaching people to go to the next level. Like, you know, you might be teaching people to go from, you know, uh, a startup to become a, an entrepreneur or, or, or a business. Um, or you might be teaching someone who wants to enter into an industry like what we do. You know, we teach people how to go from having no idea about coaching to becoming quite a masterful coach um, by going through our life coach and our master coach program. So these are, these are the sorts of things that you need to think about in order to now turn quite financial. So let me take you a little bit further. Let's get you some questions to build your programs. So the first question you could ask is how can my audience remove their pain? So whatever that might be, you know, you might be taking your audience from, I don't know how to start a business to starting a business. You might take them from, wanting to become a bricklayer to being a master bricklayer, making millions of dollars. Um, you might take them from how to, how to go from student to master teacher, you know, because they want to move into the educational space or become a literal teacher or, or a professor or a lecturer. So whatever you're able to do to take people through you can essentially build a program. And believe you me, there are many, many people who are content hungry and really want to learn from experts as to how to get from there to there. Because you know, you know, you've been there. You, you know the steps, you know what not to do, and you know what to do. So the next question to ask is, how can my audience achieve their gain? So there's pain, remove the pain, and there's also achieve the gain. So they're different questions because pain often is neurology, thinking, mindset. Gain is usually knowledge, skills, things along those particular lines. Then the next question to ask is what do they need to know? This is definitely the knowledge piece now. So what do they need to know how, do, how are you going to educate them? What are some of the key things that you need to know? Um, like, for instance, if it's moving into the business space, you know, to build a website or not to build a website, what domain to choose, what search terms to use, you know, all of those sorts of things are things that you want to start asking yourself a question in the beginning of choosing a business because that's all the heavy lifting, and it's much, much easier once you do that work. So this is the heavy lifting work. So what is the best way to put them in simple steps? So when we're thinking about building programs, 
there's lots of things that you might want to teach people, but you want to put them in a logical sequence. You don't want to put, you don't want them to do the thing that they'll typically do at the end. You don't want to teach them that at the beginning. You want to teach them that at the end or further into the program. So let me answer these for you. So if I answer the value question of I untrain people's brains to increase their income, then if I was to answer this, my answer is firstly would be how can my audience remove their pain, learn how to untrain their brain. Very simple. So, so that tells me that the journey has to be how does their brain work, how do you literally untrain some of your belief patterns, some of your neurological processes, some of your triggers, some of your emotional pain? How do you get that out? How do you remove that? So that, they would be some of the key things that I have in my program because, of course, I've answered these questions. The next is how can my audience achieve their gain? So what they've got to learn in this context is they've got to be able to move forward without fear, without blame, and without the need for certainty. Um, something I have definitely learned with all of these years of experience is you've got to let go of certainty. You know, you've got to reduce your risk, of course, you know, do your due diligence, all that sort of stuff. But you've eventually got to make peace with the fact that, you know, all achievement is risk. People who don't achieve don't risk. So what do they need to know? And my answer is courage is your currency. So if, you know, in the context of increasing your income, if you want to increase your income, you've really got to make peace with fear and you've got to recognise that every time you, you're courageous and you do something that you would normally stop doing or would stop you or create fear, they are the moments that you are moving forward. They are the moments that you're progressing. So finally, what's the best way to put them into simple steps? So, for example, what we would do in the context of helping people to increase their income by untraining their brain, we would say, you know, do the life coach and NLP practitioner training because that's going to certainly help you to untrain your brain. Masters is going to take you several steps up from that and you're going to get very, very good at those tools and be able to help anybody to do exactly that. The next piece is the speaking with confidence is a leverage piece. If you can stand on a stage and you can speak publicly without too many ums and ahs, we all do them, but some people do them far too much. If you are able to be able to speak with confidence, with certainty, with strength, then you can now completely leverage your business. So what you've got to think about is in your programs, you've got to think, what, what are the baby steps? What are the first steps? Then what are the next steps? What are the next steps and the next steps? So what you're essentially doing is sequencing them out. First of all, it's brainstorming. You know, you think about all the things that people need to learn or do in order to achieve where you're promising to take them. But then what you need to do is say, well, okay, what is the very first step they've got to take? Out of all of those steps, what's the most logical step to start at? So that's the sequencing piece. So once you can answer these questions, then you can start building your programs. You can start thinking about what are your programs. And you're not even thinking about the titles of your programs at this point. You're just putting the logical steps in place then you're thinking about, you know, what are you going to call these programs? So, for example, the things that you want to understand is at the end of the day, you know, I used to think in the beginning, you know, who's going to come to my programs? Who's going to come? 
But the thing that I realized pretty quickly is when you get your message right, the world is super hungry for your content. And uh, this is uh, one particular training. I think there's, what, about 35 people there that came into the program. And this, I think, was our master's program. But if you're going to get lots of people coming into your programs, you have to understand the rules of the game. You have to understand how they work. And that's a real key piece. So let me go into that in the Speak With Confidence piece. So let me enter in the rules of the game and, and how this essentially works. So getting your message right is the first piece. Working out what are your programs is the second piece. And the third piece is now you've got to tell people about your programs. Because if you're not telling people about your programs, no one is. And so no one knows how valuable you are. <coughs> Excuse me, I just need to grab a drink of water. So let's continue. So this is the game changer. So if you think about it, you know, Tim Ferriss is an author and speaker. Now, his net worth, I think, is now $100 million. You do not make $100 million if you're not prepared to put on some big pants. So if you want to get to those levels of income, if you want to start hitting the millions, you actually really need to use public speaking as a skill. You need to build that as a skill. And I would also suggest that you create a book. Now, of course, Tim Ferriss had lots of ideas before the four-hour work week, but this was his hit. When he wrote that particular book, it really resonated with an audience and, you know, millions and millions of people read that book and it resonated. So, of course, what you can now do once you've got your book is you can now build a program or many programs off the back of your book. Or you can do it the other way around. You can build the programs and then eventually write a book about it and that will then leverage out your message. So uh, Rich Dad Poor Dad was a roaring success for Robert Kiyosaki. And, you know, that became his story. In fact, I actually met his rich dad that he talks about in that particular book. And, you know, it's a good story. It's a really good story and one that has been, you know, boying him into the speaker space for many, many years and has earned him, you know, mega millions. Then you come to good old Nick. Now, uh, Nick wrote a book. Um, he wrote Life Without Limits, which I thought was fairly similar to, to my book, A Life Beyond Limits. And But he had a really, well, he has a really good story. And the story is that he doesn't have limbs. You know, he was born that way, yet it hasn't stopped him one iota. You know, this amazing man surfs, swims, he, he speaks on stage and he's a compelling speaker and he's got a great story, you know. So, you know, at the end of the day, he's an author and speaker and he uses those two things to really launch him into a whole new stratosphere. So... I've done exactly the same thing. So what I've essentially done is I've created my book, like Nick wrote his book, I think, in 2007, and I wrote my book in 2004. So basically what, what I did was I used public speaking and the book to be able to launch myself out into the marketplace, of course. Now, you don't have to do that. Uh, <coughs> excuse me. You don't have to do what I did. Uh, I got a publisher and I launched my book, which was distributed through Pam McMillan, which was a fantastic thing. I got into lots of bookstores and, you know, people read my book and then they wanted to come to my talks, to my trainings and so forth. So that creates that leverage piece again. 
but you don't have to write the book to get the speaking gigs, but they're a nice companion. So, you know, at the end of the day, here's one thing that I want you to understand about public speaking, because I know a lot of you are probably thinking, I've got to be an exceptional speaker. I've got to be amazing. Well, that's not really true. To really speak confidently, you don't have to be anyone else but you. You know, so, so what you need to understand is that if, you see, if you've ever heard Eddie Murphy, he's got an annoying laugh. He's not the most articulate speaker. In fact, some of his words are hard to understand. But the thing is, sure, his Hollywood status has certainly helped him in the speaking space. And he is very funny. And he started out as a stand up comedian. But the thing is, he isn't anybody but Eddie Murphy. You know, that's who he is. And that's what people love and adore and people will love and adore you but the thing that you've got to be able to do is you've got to have your thing you've got to have your message and equally if you really seriously want to make money in this space you've got to have your package so you don't have to be eddie murphy to be a successful speaker either you know you don't have to be tony robbins you don't have to be any major speaker that you're thinking of right now you just have to be you. <coughs> and uh, it helps if you don't cough as well. I think I need more water. Thank you. So let's continue. So let's now look at the three formulas that made us millions. Message, package, present. It's the three phase power package. So, you know, what we did is we used our message, we used our package, and we presented our message to a large audience, and that allowed us to create our own bank. So basically, this three-phase formula is how our business prospered for 21 years. Now, our message is, as you well know, untrain your brain to increase your income. That was essentially our message. Now, I have many messages now, but in the very beginning, it was based around that. That's really when our wheels started turning on our business, when our message really hit a chord. Now, what I was doing in the very early days is most of everything I was doing was helping people to get beyond their income limit. So what I then did is I packaged that our package was essentially this is before we had our masters and speakers and trainers and all our other programs. But I just had one program. And that was our life coach and NLP practitioner training. Of course, I then continued on with my own training, and then eventually became a master NLP trainer. But in the early days, that's our program. So what we did is when we presented our program, it created the opportunity for us to say, hey, if you want to untrain your brain, <coughs> excuse me, to increase your income, what we're going to do is we're going to reduce our price for that. So what we would do is we would discount our full price and then we would discount it down down to 3775, for example. So what would happen in that moment is you would have an audience who were listening to you talk about what do you need to do in order to untrain your brain to increase your income? What do you need to do? Now, I would share all of the what, all of the ways in which you need to think and, and what you need to think and, and, and all of that. But in order for people to be able to learn how, they would have to come into that program because that's where we store all the how. And that was our Rolls Royce in the very early days. That was our accredited program. So people could become accredited coaches as a result of coming into that program. 
So, and they could do it for just 3775 when other people were marketing similar things up around 5,000 and 6,000. And, and you look around and you try to get a coaching program where that's accredited for under five grand and good luck. So it was a good price offer. And so what it did is a magic number was 265. So when we got to our 265th student, what happened is we earned $1 million. So that was $1 million to us. So the thing is that it pays to really get this formula right because when you do get it right and you use your message with a good package and you present it to an audience who see the value and already know there's value in what you do, then you are going to get people who jump into your programs and then pay you for that. And if you get your numbers right, then you can definitely do incredibly well. Now, of course, when we hit our next number of 265 students, we're now into our second million and so forth. So at the end of the day, once you get the first two pieces right and you get your pitch right and your talk right, then all you have to do is rinse and repeat, rinse and repeat, rinse and repeat. We've been rinsing and repeating for 21 years now. So, you know, this is the thing that we've been doing over and over again. Now, the first thing you need to think about is it's not just about the money either. The more successful we are at what we do, the more lives that change as a result, the more people get value as a result. Now, the great thing is we now have trained so many coaches and not only that, we go right up to trainer training. So we've trained so many trainers that they are now duplicating what we're doing. So as a result, more and more people are being helped because of the work that we did and because of the heavy lifting we did in the beginning to get this formula right. So this three-phase formula is based on one powerful formula, and I want to share what's underneath this a little further. So it was a, actually a mentor of mine many years ago that gave me this formula that really opened the door. Now, many people know this formula as a result of him teaching me and me teaching many other people. And so many people now know that the formula to wealth is two words, value times leverage. So what that essentially means, you know, when you ask how do you create wealth with that formula is that what you do is you constantly improve your value. How do you do that? You do more reading, you do more training, you do more practice. Um, and so that's how you increase your value. So whatever it is that you have as value, you probably got that from learning from someone, practicing it, perfecting it, and getting really, really good at it. And as a result, you became valued in that area. Just like Tim Ferriss got, you know, valued being able to structure his business so that he could work for four hours in a week and make everything that he needed in his business. So the next piece, the leverage piece, is you can have all the value in the world, like you could be the best in the world. But if people don't know that you are the best or among the best, then there's no value. So the leverage piece is essentially the talks, the books, the getting out to large audiences. And when you do that with your value, that's how you get yourself to positions like this. So I hope you really understand this. I hope this is making a lot of sense for you. By the way, when we get to the end, if you do have any questions, maybe write them down and I'm more than happy to answer any questions. I do have a training, which is at seven o'clock, but I'm happy to answer any questions that you might have as long as we're off this webinar, you know, a bit before seven, but I promise you we will. So this 
is how you actually really master this particular formula. But let me actually go through the literal detail so you can know how to do this. So this, by the way, from here on, this is for the serious people. This is for the committed people. This is for the people that really want to be able to know how do you do this? How do you go deep? And how do you make this work for me? How do you make it work for you? So what I'd like to do is let's go under the hood. You know, if you're not a mechanic, it can get a little bit complex as you lift the hood on your car, particularly these days. And uh, so what I want to do is I want to lift the hood on this so you can actually see inside to get a sense of what is it that you've got to do now to go even deeper than the depth that I've taken you. As I say, this is for the committed people. This is for people who really want success. So let me show you how to do that. So the real key pieces that we can actually give you are the speaker piece. So if you're not trained as a public speaker, then you really do need to get that level of training. Not just the training to be a public speaker, but you've also got to learn what do you need to say on stage to be able to sell your programs, your packages. And that's what we do in that particular program. The next piece is the program piece. So Income Incubator is a program that we created. It's available online even now. And this particular program we built during COVID because we had so many of our students who, you know, who all of a sudden went, oh, my God, COVID, lockdowns, lockouts, all of that. And they came to us and they said, how do you guys make money online, you know, while you sleep? How do you do that? Can you show us? So we said to our students, look, let's build this program, but let's build it with you. And uh, so what we did is we priced it really low and we brought in a whole bunch of our students and they came into the program and we asked them lots of questions, you know, like what, what else do you need to know? What else do you need to know? And we ended up building Income Incubator, which literally teaches people from go to woe or what, you know, to how do you build an online program? And also, how do you build live programs? And the next piece is the author piece. So this is a program that we built many, many years ago. And it was, how do you publish? How do you publish a book? How do you think about a book? How do you name a book? How do you price a book? How do you write a book? How do you structure a book? And all of that. So when you have the speaker piece, the online piece, and the author piece, now you can duplicate what we've been able to do. So <clears throat> this helps you in the presenting space. This helps you in the packaging space. And this helps you in the message space. Because when you're, when you're considering a book, what you can actually do is you've got to really think about what is my message and, and how am I putting it together? And this often helps you equally in the packaging space when you're building your programs. So these are the things that help you to build your own bank. When you get these three things really well put together, you can basically just rinse and repeat too and start creating your own income. But this is how you earn income in chunks like in big chunks. The very first time I did this, um, I earned three months of my prior income in the lead up. In one talk, I earned three months income. And then I did it again and I thought I was going to earn the same income and I ended up earning a whole year's income in one talk. So when you perfect this, it can actually, you can start earning annual incomes in just a talk. And many, many people do this. Many people do this now. So let me get deeper into this. So this is our speaker training. 
And these are the things that we teach within our speaker training. So inside of this program, you learn how to structure your talk in a tenth of the time that usually takes. This is a big holdup. This is the thing that slows people down enormously. They have a 45 keynote talk, 45 minute keynote talk, and they spend the whole weekend writing it, designing it, creating it. I want to reverse that. I want to show you how you could do a whole weekend training and you can put it together in just a couple of hours. And there's, there is a very, very specific way to do things fast. And of course, there are lots of ways to do them slow. So the next thing is you also learn the psychology of stage positions, where to stand and why to stand. This is a critical piece in knowing how to actually use your stage as a communication device. And it's a completely different communication when you're at the front of the stage than it is if you're at the back, to the left or to the right of the stage, and all these pieces in the middle. So we will show you the psychological stage positions and where to actually stand and what does it communicate. So this is very, very important in the context of if you're using a stage to sell your actual programs because you've got to be in the right spot when you're doing various pieces of your delivery. The next thing you learn is how to get in the best speaker state. So getting into a good speaker state is so, so critical because how you feel is what you say. I'll say it again, how you feel is what you say and how you say it. So it is very, very important to know how to get yourself into a speaker state. Also, remove all those annoying ums, ahs, and ers. And when I say it, just, you know, reading this for you, it goes into your brain. So now I have to consciously stop myself from umming and ahring and erring. But a lot of speakers do this too much. And every time you um and you are and you err, you're not giving any value to an audience, but more so what you're doing is you're dropping your credibility. The more ums and ahs, the more credibility you lose as you speak. So we show you in our speaker program how to completely untrain your brain of those. The next piece is discover how to turn your message into a six or even seven figure income. So inside of this, we will actually literally show you the structure. In our speaker training, we also look at your programs. You know, what sort of programs can you put together that's going to deliver the sort of level income that you need? And we'll show you how to script it, how to configure it, and how to actually deliver it so that people do buy your actual programs. And that's a critical piece. This piece is also a piece that some people need, not all people need it, but many people do need to completely get rid of your fear of public speaking. Public speaking is a fantastic skill and it's a great skill because you can really connect with a lot of people. But if you're shaking or if you're fearful of public speaking, well, it's going to show and you're not going to put on the best performance and you're not going to give people value, and that's why they're there. So in our speaker course, we completely get rid of your fear of public speaking. Of course, the, the net outcome is to get you from never having spoken before on stage or having spoken before on stage, either way, to get you to keynote ability so you can actually deliver a keynote talk professionally. And that's what's most important and confidently with clarity. So uh, this comes from, there was an R there. This comes from uh, Christina Morrison. She said, uh, Rick Schnabel, you rock. Since working with you, I've got coaching clients coming out of my ears. Now, she was a Baywatch actor many years ago. She came from Banning, California in the U.S., 
And she didn't think that she could ever get coaching clients. She came through our life coach and NLP practitioner training, learned all the skills of coaching. So she was an excellent coach by the time she finished her training. But the piece that she really needed was how to get coaching clients. So she did our speaker training and I showed her how to put a package together, how to be able to get up on stage and present in a compelling way and what to say and how to say it, when to say it and where to say it. And she then utilized that to get clients coming. And she also said she got the speaker bug. She loved getting up there on stage and doing her thing. Mandy Siegel, she said, Rick is an excellent trainer, full of inspiration, expertise, and always delivers beyond the promises he makes. This course helped me to grow into a successful full-time coach and trainer. Feels weird saying these testimonials when they're about you, but they're testimonials and uh, they're testimonials about the speaker training. And she also went on to do trainer training. So if this has even got you mildly curious about our program. What we're going to do is I'm going to completely lower the price of this program to a nutso level. And the reason that I want to do that is our speaker training is almost full. We just, we're just we just looking for a couple more students is all we're looking for and we want to fill our speaker training and so as a result we have decided to completely reduce the price on our speaker training and i'm going to give you some special bonuses that i think you will find quite exciting so here's what you get if you've decided that hey i really want to do this and i really want to monetize my message and i want to put myself out there and grow my business then our speaker training is normally 5960. Now we're reducing that and we're making it 2997, which is the lowest price that we've ever done on our speaker training. So that is our ridiculous price. And I hope that's enticing to you. If not, if you think, oh gee, you know, cash flow is a bit of an issue, well, let's make it easy. We also have a 12 month program, which is only 257. Or if you even wanna pay it over 24 months, means you can do the training and then just pay it off, means you can actually use the skill, make the money and then pay it all out if you want to. But for as little as 147, over 24 months, you can do this program. So, I'm also going to give you some bonuses with this. This is an amazing program. It will build your confidence to no end. It really, really will. If you're just looking for confidence, you'll definitely get that, but you'll get a whole lot more with this particular program. Now, the awesome bonuses, if you've already made up your mind about this and you're going to jump into this program, just wait because there, there is some more things that I want to give you. And I think these are a marriage made in heaven. So the next bonus or the first bonus I want to give you is Income Incubator. So this is a course that you can start straight away and we'll give you the link to this. It's a self-paced program. You just go through it at your own pace and you can do the first module and do what you've got to do to start building your course and then do the next module, start applying that and then just keep going to build your course. Now that's our first bonus. This particular program, you learn how to find the rivers of gold in your head and then put them into a course. So what we do is we ask you lots of questions like, what do you know that no one else knows? Or what do you know that you're really, really good at? And once you learn how to do this, you can put all of your ideas into various courses. The really cool thing about this is that you can earn money while you sleep, literally. So what you do is we'll teach you the 10 steps 
to enter the $320 billion online course industry. It's huge and it's getting bigger and bigger and bigger. So we'll show you all of the steps to essentially build your own bank with that as well. Also, you learn how to develop the right price and title and how to automate absolutely everything. So this program, what it actually does is it teaches you how to build the program, but then how to structure it. And you don't have to be highly techy with this. It's a lot of drag and drop sort of stuff. And you can build an online program and just leave it to other people to get it and get into it. And you don't have to do anything. This program literally shows you how to plan, build, and design online courses that sell while you sleep. In fact, we'll show you a few platforms that you can basically put your online courses there and they'll sell it for you. And uh, we've been doing this for years. We get paid. It just goes automatically into our account. The only thing that we do is read the emails that come through that say, you've got another student, you've got another student, you've got another student. So it's a very, very cool program. So um, this is someone who did our, this Marilyn was one of the people who came into our program at the very, very beginning. And she was one of the students that I spoke about uh, in the beginning. Now, this was the testimonial she gave us. She said, I believed no one would listen to me, but I was wrong. In just a few weeks, I got 1,902 people enrolled in my online course. I was gobsmacked that a grandmother could succeed online. You can hear immediately where her limitations were. She thought, oh, my God, I've got to be so techy. I've really, really got to be, you know, know my computer and know all these programs. And you don't. You really, really don't. These days, it is so, so easy to put your course online. And everything that you need to know is in the course. So all you do is you just follow the course. But the great thing is, uh, and I, I love her testimonial because, because she literally is a grandmother and uh, she's retired. And what she did is she, I said to her, I said, what's your super skill? What's, what's your super skill? And she said, I can teach English. I can teach kids to read. So there are now literally tens of thousands of students in her program that are all learning to read, which is awesome. You know, so her market was uh, typically kids that were a bit reading challenged. And uh, so as a result, she's helping so many kids. So it's very, very cool. So that is Marilyn. And that was our very first bonus. This is our second. And I'm I know you thought, hey, he's going to give us the Publish program. Yes. So the Publish program is a really, really cool program. This, just to give you a little bit of an insight, this particular program I did uh, after being uh, a, a published author with, with a publishing company. I've been published by two publishing companies. But I wanted to perfect how do I self-publish as well? So this shows you all three, you know, how to, how to get a publisher, how to self-publish, and, you know, how to actually write a book that other people can promote and sell too. So what's inside this particular program? You find your message. So it shows you actually how to find your message first. And then it shows you how to turn your message into a best selling book. Now, this particular one piece, uh, I discovered this when I was doing a talk in Melbourne, I think. And what happened was uh, I had someone who came up to me in one of the breaks and said, uh, how did you, you know, get a best selling book? How did you do that? And I just shrugged my shoulders and I said, I sold a lot of books. And she said, oh, you did it the hard way. And I went, what? My ears pricked up. And she said, there's an easier way than just selling a ton of books. And I said, how? She put me in touch with someone. I paid them $5,000 to learn how to do that. 
And we then turned every single one of our books into a best-selling book. Yes, there is the fast way and there's numerous slow ways. So we like fast and so that's why we like to teach because we like to find the fast way. So there is a model. Now, um, what you'll also learn is the easiest steps to actually write a book and what are the ways that you can do it. Now, actually, um, while it says the easiest steps to write a book, there is even a way that you can publish a book without writing one word. And uh, it's a really cool technique. Uh, personally, not my favorite technique. I prefer to go the, the old fashioned way with writing but there are ways that you can actually write a book without writing. And finally, that other little piece, how to turn it into a bestseller. And uh, this is the icing on the cake. If you have a best-selling book, it brings your credibility up. So it's a really good title to have uh, a bestseller, and many of ours have become a number one bestseller. The very first time I tried the strategy, I actually got number one, which was really, really cool. I didn't think it was going to be number one. Uh, bestseller is when you're in the top 10, uh, but number one bestseller is fantastic. So here's what you get. You get our speaker training. You also get our income incubator, which is immediate access. So, you know, the moment you come into the program, You'll get a link and you get immediate access into that. You equally get immediate access into our published program as well. So the total value of these programs is 15,954. Of course, we're not upping the price. We're keeping it exactly the same. So it's 2775 and you get all three programs. And this is a great, great you know, three-phase power again using these three programs. It's awesome, awesome value. I really challenge you to find anyone giving you all of this for that very, very small price. Plus, of course, you can pay it off in 12 months or 24 months and get access immediately. So you also get full support. Yep, I'm going to give you this as well. So you actually get six by 30 minute Zoom sessions to help you through any of the steps of the training. So if you're stuck at any point, you've got actual visual support so we can get up there and go, oh, you move this and you move that and turn that on and do this. So we can literally show you. Or what you can do is you've got 12 months email access so you can say, hey, got a problem with this. How can I fix this or how can I do that? you've got 12 months of email access as well. So we put a value of two and a half thousand on that. And that we're not upping the price at all. It's same. So here is what you need to do. You need to basically be sure that you do this before Thursday, the 12th of October at midnight. That is when this finishes. This is why I said we're looking for the committed people and the serious players, the people who really want to put on the big pants and jump at the top end of town. So what you can do is if you need to talk to somebody about this a little bit more, want to get a little bit more detail, then you can click that button. Now, this is available at lifebeyondlimits.com.au forward slash speaker training. Uh, excuse the helicopters. We've got some fires uh, north of us at the moment. So um, it's lifebeyondlimits.com.au forward slash speaker hyphen training. And I'll make sure that I put this link in the chat as well. So the early bird prices end at midnight doesn't mean you can't get this program you can after thursday october 12 but of course the price is going to revert back to the normal price and the bonuses won't be part of it so if you definitely want this then you can either schedule a call the moment you schedule that call we will hold these prices for you even if you cannot 
connect with us because we're usually bombarded when we do these things. If you cannot connect with us before midnight, Thursday, October 12, we will hold this price for you. You just have to schedule the call and make sure you do it before Thursday, October 12. And then what you could also do is if you want the small payment, you click on that button. If you want the 12-month payment, you click on that button. But if you want the biggest discount and you want to pay up front, you click that button. That's as simple as it is. And again, as I say, I'll make sure that I put the link in the chat as well. So the speaker training starts on Friday, the 3rd of November. This is actually live training. The dates are on the website and you'll see the actual dates. So the way that we run it is we usually run it in the evenings and on some weekends. So that way what you can do is it doesn't interfere with your employ, employment or your, or your business or your work. So that way you can do these trainings. Typically what we do is on the first training on Friday, the 3rd of November, that's a welcome. We talk about what we're going to be covering and we prepare you to go into the program and what you're going to get from the program and get you all ready. Then after that, we start going module after module after module. So all trainings are live, but they're also recorded and you get lifetime access. So if you miss any trainings, never mind. You can actually watch the recordings. And if you want to review any of the trainings, if you want to go, oh, what, what did he actually say there? Let me go through it. It's all lifetime access. And plus you get it all in a manual as well. So you get everything that you need to go back to it at any time and go into deeper detail when you need to. It's all there. You also get income incubator and published program, just to reiterate on those. And uh, so it's 2775 or 12 monthly payments of 257 or 24 monthly payments of 147. So that is the deal that's on the table. That is the link. So it's lifebeyondlimits.com.au forward slash speaker hyphen training. Now, if you have any questions and you really want to access me personally, then here is my email. So you can send me any questions that you have about the program, about the offer. So it's rick, R-I-K dot schnabel, S-C-H-N-A-B-E-L at lifebeyondlimits.com.au. And uh, I'll pop that in the chat as well. So thank you so much for being with me tonight and going through all of this with me. And uh, I'm going to now grab those links and pop them in the chat as I promised.